although this is a play about um, a very dark night in Russian history, um, it's chock full of humour. Um, it's a comedy. It's uh, got some crazy characters in it that play the very inept assassins uh, that did away with Rasputin and it's got um, some of Australia's finest actors and my favourite actors in it um, to really punch through that comedy. Um, even though I knew that this, uh, this n what happened to this man on this night was a really, really awful thing for him, it was, he didn't die. He was like the Terminator, he just kept coming back. Um, but there was also, there was also the, the planning and the, the detail that went into his assassination was quite funny. I mean, they tried to do him away with pink pink cupcakes. That's not a spoiler either. So, um, so when you're starting with pink cupcakes and you're ending with the death of one of the biggest tyrants in Russian history, you know you're in for a roller king ride. I'm so excited to work on another play of Kate Mulvaney's because she's such an extraordinary writer. When I picked up this script um, two pages in, I was just completely cacking myself. Um, she's so wonderful at writing dialogue. After doing Good People, I just love working at this company and I'm so excited to be here again. Uh, because I'm also an actor as well as a playwright, I always make sure that my plays um, have characters that I know that the actors will really get their teeth into and everyone gets their moment of fun in the spotlight and, and this play is no exception and when we've got a cast like the one we have you can guarantee that there's going to be a lot of mischief on stage.